Hi there and welcome back. This is Striker Disco. It's a pleasure to be here with you all. In this lesson, I'm gonna teach you about the object pronouns. Salut tout le monde, moi c'est Striker Disco et c'est un plaisir pour moi là avec vous tous. Ma vidéo ça va l'enseigner qui s'appelle object pronouns. The object pronouns. Do not forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Okay, so let's jump into it. Now, what is an object pronoun? Qu'est-ce qu'est qui object pronoun? An object pronoun receives the action of a verb. I understand? An object pronoun receives the action of a verb. Okay, now let's go. As you can see here, the subject pronoun. I, you, he, she, it, we, do, they. Ça c'est le leçon qui est pour étudier let me tell you here. Subject pronoun. Ça c'est subject pronoun. On a la leçon ça on va l'apprendre object pronoun. Object pronoun. Okay, now let's go. The object pronoun for I is me. Me. The object pronoun for I is me. Now, the object pronoun for you is you. It don't change. Li pa change. It's the same. Okay? The object pronoun for he, it used for man, is her. And the object pronoun for she, it used for a woman, is her. And the object pronoun for it, it don't change also. It, it. It does say, and here these are all for singular. These are all for singular. The sub, the object pronoun for I is is me. The object pronoun for you is you. It's the same. And the object pronoun for he is him. The object pronoun for she is her. And the object pronoun for it it's it. It don't change. Okay. Now let's go. The object pronoun for the object pronoun for we is. Us. Us. The object pronoun for you is you also. It don't change. And the object pronoun for they is them. Them. The object pronoun for we is us. The object pronoun for you is you, it don't change. And the object pronoun for they is them. And these are all for low. Okay. Let's make a review for you. The object pronoun for I is me. The object pronoun for you is you. It's the same. The object pronoun for he it used for man is him. And the object pronoun for she is her. The object pronoun for it is it. It's the same. The object pronoun for we is us. And the object pronoun for you is you is the same and the object pronoun for they is them this is some sentences with the object pronouns for me i say be care saw me today be care saw me today for you i said this lesson will help you all to learn english 
Could you repeat after me? This lesson will help you all to learn English. For him, it was for a man. I saw him this morning. Has no lesson for you, Abel. I say, I saw him this morning. In her, I say, it is used for a woman. I say, my knee is my boss. I saw her yesterday. My knee is my boss. I saw her yesterday. For it, I say, it is a big chair. It is a big chair. It is a big chair. For us, I say, Peter and I work for a big company. You can find us on the internet. I say, Peter and I work for a big company. You can find us on the internet. You can say on the internet or you can say on the internet. Okay, for you, I say I saw you driving a bus this morning. I saw you driving a bus this morning. Okay, and for them, I say the children are happy today. The mother took them to the park. The children are happy today. Their mother took them to the park. You can notice this is some sentences. I'm gonna explain you what is an object pronoun. What is people say? An object pronoun in people. I saw Tom today. I saw Tom today. I is the subject. Saw, it is the verb, this is the verb, and Tom, it is the, ob it is the object. If I want to replace Tom by an object, I can say, I saw him today. I saw him today. You know, Tom, it is a boy. We use, I say, I replace Tom by an object, I say, I saw him today. In the second sentence that I have, I work with Tom today. I work with Tom today. In this sentence, I, it is the subject. Work, it is the verb. And with, with, it is the proposition. It is the proposition. And Tom, it is the object. If I want to replace it by an object, I can say, I work with him. I work with him today. What do I have a big here? I work with him today. I say we use him for a meal. In the third sentence, I have Tom likes Maria. In this sentence, Tom. It is the subject. Likes it is the verb, and Maria is the object. Tom likes Maria. If I want to replace Maria by an object, I can say Tom likes her. Mo placer by un object pronoun. I say Tom likes her. You know Maria is a girl. We use her for a woman. Okay? I think that you understand. Okay? Là, on va montrer comment vous poser des questions pendant que vous utilisez object pronouns. Okay? I can say, Who does he, who does Tom like? Does Tom like? Ask me a question, was it? The word who it is an object pronoun. And Tom it is the subject. Like it is the verb. 
and we use does to ask this question. We see is a does that could pose a question. I said, who does Tom like? If I want to replace Tom by or subject pronouns, since I may replace Tom with a pronoun personal subject, I'm capable to say, who does he he like? Who does he like? I say that we use he for all men. Utilize he for young guys. Who does he like? We replace he by Tom. Okay? Have a good one. Have the he he likes he likes Maria. He likes Maria. As you can see, he likes Maria. And the subject, the verb, and the object. If I want to, if I want to replace, replace Maria by an object, I can say he likes her. He likes her. You understand? Yes, I think so that you understand. That's all for today. Na lesson ça, c'est tout ça nous t'ai pour vous dire. Mais lesson ça vous faut apprendre object pronouns. Make sure that you understand this this lesson. Assure que vous comprenez lesson ça je dis. Do not forget to like and subscribe for more exciting videos. It was a nice moment to be here with you all and I say goodbye. See you next.